Hello everyone, hope you are doing great. Welcome to Elias Tech channel. If you're new here, welcome. And I'm so happy to see you all once again. Um, all right, so in this lecture, we're gonna learn about a very basic things, which is very important. What I noticed that if we go to the higher level, sometimes we forget the very, very basic stuff, like how to uh, reset the admin password. All right, let's dive into this topic with a bit more details. Guys, one thing you should keep in your mind as a technical person that, um, um, just give me one second, let me type the admin password. All right, I'm glad that I remember the password. <laughs> it was, um, a, B, C, two, three. Okay, it's ABC at one, two, three. If you want to hack my computer, go ahead. I don't mind. This is um, it's not registered Windows. Just keep in your mind. All right, so let's get the ball rolling. I'm here. I'm going to come to where I'm going to come to Active Directory, or we can say yes, Active Directory users and computers. You have to. Uh, I think I messed up. Let me start from scratch. <laughs> All right, so yeah, you have to come back to Trek Store or you have to come Server Manager. Once you get to Server Manager in here, you don't have to go to Manage. You have to come to Tools. When you get here, this prompts make me crazy. All right, when you get the Tools, what you're going to do is you have to come to Active Directory User and Computers. Click in here. So there are very important things that I'm going to share with I was about to see with both of you. I don't know who are you, <laughs> but anyway, it's very important to share with all of you is that one thing you should keep in your mind. One is a built-in user. Guys, remember we discuss about built-in user, and if it is not, then yes, we have a built-in user. Once you install Windows Server 2022, and you will see that some of the window, some of the users are built-in. And another is, or we can say, non-built-in user or custom created user as well. So these are the built-in users, or we can say built-in groups as well. So we have a built-in groups, we have a built-in users. Means once you install Windows operating system, it is not only Windows Server 2022, but from very earlier early stage of Windows operating system. It does come with this kind of strategy that it should come with some built-in groups and user as well. All right. So just keep in your mind as a technical person. So we have users. These are group, replication, remote managed, uh, yeah, remote management user, remote desktop user. Remember that. So you can add them, add the users. Or you can assign a user to be a member of remote desktop user, meaning those users will allow to access the computer remotely. So these are uh, these uh, these are um, more like we can say power user. I do remember there is a backup operation groups as well, but we do have a built-in users as well. That was built-in group, and this is built-in user. All right, so the question is how to change our administrator password. Let's right click. Um, once you get here, you have to right click and reset the password. Don't mess with admin uh, with administrator password. Just keep in your mind. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put this one as a lowercase abc at one two three four abc at one two three four. So I want to change it to one two three abc abc at one two three four so this is how you can reset your admin password and one thing you should keep in your mind that we have a domain admins as well for example if anyone is member of this domain so administrator is also member of domain admin so eliastic i have a specific user which is called eliastic it is also member of administrator a user or we can say domain admins controller um, anyway this is how you can reset the password all right guys i hope this information was very helpful uh, uh, if you think it was very helpful 
what you're waiting for go ahead and share this um, the video with your friend with your colleague with whoever you think they pursue this kind of information until next time one thing you should keep in your mind as a stay safe be brave and constantly chase the technology i'm sure you will never regret all right see you then in the next videos